This has been a very exciting project, as you know. It's uh, for many years people have wanted the proper wall, and we have a wall that the likes of which very few places have ever seen. I wanted to show you some of the details of the wall. Uh, you can say you can see a pretty good view. Uh, this is going to be close to 500 miles by the time we finish. Those are the areas that are most important. Uh, after we're completed, five that should be done pretty close to next year. Over, it'll be over 400 miles, and we think we can get it close to 500 miles by the end of next year, depending on certain terrain conditions. Uh, but we're doing all of the most important areas. We have a lot of natural barriers like mountains and streams and rivers and some pretty vicious and violent rivers, actually. Uh, but it's, uh, it's an amazing project. And as one of the folks just said, it really is virtually impenetrable. Uh, any walls that were put up would get knocked down very quickly, very easily. This wall is not something that can be really knocked down. I guess anything can, but this is very tough. And uh, it goes down six feet. It's three and four feet wide. The concrete, you see it right here, it's exposed. This wall can't be climbed. This is very, very hard. And what the panel does on top, as I said, is structural, but it's also very hard to get by that panel. Plus, it's designed to absorb heat, so it's extremely hot. The wall is, uh, you won't be able to touch it. You can, you can uh, fry an egg on that wall. It's very, very hot. So if they're going to climb it, they're going to have to bring hoses and waters, uh, water, and we don't know where they're going to hook it up because there's not a lot of water out here. So it's a very, very hard thing to climb. Uh, 